What's up, hungry people? It's Rex with Eat Magazine and Eat OC Now. I'm here with Cynthia. We're at Angelo and Vinci's, and we're talking about space. Well, banquet space, yeah. uh, event facilities. And so if you need space, Angelo and Vinci's has got lots of space. But first, a toast. Buona cose, tanto cose, grande cose, sempre che salute e amore, which means good things to you, lots of good things to you, grand things to you, always with health and love. I'll drink to pretty much anything, but for sure I'll drink to that. <laughs> Cynthia, tell us a little bit about the spaces at Angelo and Vinci's. Great, we do. We do have three banquet rooms, uh, small, medium, and large, that can accommodate up to 390 people. Our Romeo and Juliet room, the smallest room, can accommodate up to 80 people. The mid-sized room, the Sicilian room, can accommodate up to 130, and the largest room can accommodate up to 180, or you can combine all three to accommodate almost 400 guests. We have two private rooms in the restaurant that can accommodate each up to 40 people, or if you just want to be in and out quick in a little two-hour window, we can do a casada party with your own private buffet. Wow, that was really good. Was that fast Yeah, enough? that was great. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. Okay, good. We should have done that right from the very beginning. <laughs> Okay, so I'm not talking anymore. We're just gonna turn it over Aww. to Cynthia for the whole time. Let's take a look inside the banquet rooms. This is the Venetian room. In all our banquet rooms, it's a real party atmosphere. There are no overhead lights. It's very theatrical. Uh, we've got the, the twinkle lights. Each room is themed to the Venetian room, obviously, as Venice. So we have posters of the Venetian Carnivali and the flags and the fun of Venice. So we have 36 different colors of linen, and that enables you to personalize the look of your event. Each room has a fully stocked bar. We have a variety of options as far as the beverages. You can limit the beverages by the type of beverage you want on your bill, by the time, by the, uh, the dollar amount, lots of different options. We try to be as flexible as possible with our pricing, not only for the bars, but for the buffets as well. In-house DJs are trained not only as ditch jockeys, but to work as a team with the staff in the room. So if you're planning something special, like a wedding reception, our DJ becomes your master of ceremonies, makes all the announcements, lets your guests know we call everybody table by table to the buffet. They all work as a team to assure a very smooth running event. So that's the Venetian room. We hope to see you. This is a combination of our Romeo and Juliet room and our Venetian room for those larger parties. Two bars, private entrance, and the DJ system is equally linked volume-wise into both rooms, so there's no problem hearing the dance music. It's the smallest of our three banquet rooms and probably the most booked. It's a great size for a party of 80 people or less. One of the things I love is the balcony of love. You can see Romeo climbing up the balcony to his Juliet. And that's our Romeo and Juliet room. This combination of the Sicilian room and Venetian room can accommodate up to 300 people. This is a great room because it has two levels. We have a balcony level as well as this ground floor. The brides and grooms love this balcony level because we actually sneak them through a wonderful glamorous storage area where they make their entrance through their upstairs guests, down the staircase, through their downstairs guests to the head table. We have a separate buffet upstairs here so these guests do not have to walk up and down the stairs with their food. But it's always a great view from upstairs down onto the dance floor. The head table is clearly visible. It's a great action viewpoint. And here we are to the second level of the restaurant we call the mezzanine level. It overlooks the main dining room and the love nest which is a little getaway for our brides and grooms when they arrive. We bring them to the love nest to have a drink and a private moment to themselves before they enter into their exciting wedding reception. Here oftentimes we have our larger re reservations because we're able to push the tables together better. And um, you can have anything from a party of 10 to a party of 20 or one of those little casada parties for up to 100 people right here on the mezzanine. So now I'd love to show you the Stanza di Luna, the room of the moon, right this way. So here, it's a mystical, magical space as if you're dining on the moon. If you're dining on the moon, we would have the earth rising on the far side of the room. This is our terrace. It's an outdoor space, can accommodate up to 40 people. It's a great space. It's al fresco in the summer, enclosed in plexiglass in the winter, and it's got a beautiful view of the Plummer Auditorium. There you go, Angelo's and Vinci's. Amazing space. All kinds of stuff going on here. Come check it out. Ready. Okay. <laughs> Ready. Ready. Let's try this again. Okay. Now you're doing all the work. 
Well, I'm going to turn it over to you in a second okay. here because you seem to know it a lot better than I do. <laughs> You've got a casada room, which is the... The casada okay. party is a, it's a little... <laughs> you, got, you got too much space. <laughs> I know. Oh my well, God. Well, it's easy because if you want to stay... I think normal. I need some of this. This is... I, I'm <laughs> gonna, let's, let's start drinking right now. Okay, let's, let's do that. Okay. Angelo's and Vinci's. That's it. Okay. Plural and plural. And after Michelangelo and Leonardo da Vinci. Yeah. <laughs> I figured that's who it was. <laughs> I mean, I guess I didn't really think about it that much, but I, I probably could have figured that one out. Steven with Frank Sinatra, Shirley MacLaine, Dean Martin, and Carmen Phillips. I think that's Frank Sinatra and that's Dean Martin. Did I say it backwards? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> this is my favorite photograph here. <laughs> 